Are you an Android enthusiast? Who's always wanted to run Android apps on your Windows 10 computer? But don't want to deal with the hassle of using an emulator? Well, you're in luck in this video. We'll show you an incredible method that allows you to run Android apps on Windows 10 without an emulator and yes, even play games. So let's get started. First of all, open Start Menu and search for Turn Windows Features On Off. Then open it and enable the following features. First, enable the Hyper-V, second virtual machine platform, and Windows Hypervisor. Then press OK and restart your PC. Also make sure the system virtualization is enabled from BIOS. Now open the link given in the description. This is an open source project by Magisk. It will help you to run Android subsystem on Windows 10. Now we have to download this file for Windows 10. Just click on it. Now, scroll down and download the one on the top. This file contains all the Google Play apps. Just click on it to start downloading. I'm using IDM to download this app. If you want IDM for free, watch this video. I skipped the video, so now open the folder. Then extract the file. I'm using WinRAR. If you want WinRAR for free, watch this video. It will take some time, so I will speed up the video. After it done extracting, move the folder to C drive and also rename the folder. Move it to the C drive. Find the program called Run and run it as administrator. It will automatically start installing Windows SIB system for Android. It's successfully installed now, you can close the PowerShell and these two windows. Now open your browser and search for Google Play Store APK. Open the top one. Once it downloaded, move it to desktop. Now, open the Microsoft Store. Then search for WSA Tool.
Install this one. Now close the Microsoft Store and open Settings. Then search for Developer Settings. Now enable the Developer Mode and close the window. Then go to the Start menu and open Windows Subsystem. And go to the Advanced Settings and enable Developers Mod. Now go to the Start menu again and open the app that we installed from Store. Click on Settings Gear. And enable for WSA only and close the app. Now double click on this APK file and click on Download to set up ADB. Click on Start WSA and wait for 3 or 4 minutes. It will take 3 minutes to add Play Store on Start Menu. Check it frequently. It's been almost 3 minutes, let's check it again. Play Store is successfully installed. Now close the APK installer, then we can open Play Store. For the first time, it will take some time. In my case it took 1 minute, so I will skip the video. As you can see friends, it's working. Now you can sign into your account and install apps and games. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching.